Okay everyone, so in this video we're gonna test out the new T-Rex release in iOS. Alright, so the new release from T-Rex is 0.24.7. The only difference for iOS is that in Windows uh, they uh, update every one minute on average. So in iOS they have it set to 30 seconds for T-Rex. So it may seem like it's more uh, fluctuating the hash rate in iOS. So what we can do uh, is we can add this extra config so we will also update every 60 seconds like Windows. All right so we're gonna add this as well. So in this tutorial we're gonna try to get 47 plus for my RTX 3060 Ti uh, with this Samsung memory, all right? So the card is Gigabyte GeForce RTX 3060 Ti Eagle OC8G, all right? So all we have to do is just go into your HiOS account. We're gonna go into the farm and after that we're just gonna go to flight sheets. We're gonna create a new flight sheet. We're gonna select the coin. So in my case, I'm gonna use Ethereum. We're gonna select the wallet. If you don't have a wallet, just create a wallet, add your uh, Ethereum address, name the wallet, and just click on create. Simple as that. After that, we're gonna go to the pool. I'm using Ethermine, but you can use your favorite pool if you like. And just choose uh, the closest server to you. So in my case, I'm in Europe. After that, we're gonna go and click on apply. Now we're gonna go and select the miner. Of course, in this tutorial, we're gonna select T-Rex miner. This is for NVIDIA cards, and we're gonna go and click on select minor config. So we want to make sure that we want to choose the latest one because this is this one, 0.24.7. If you are in the future, you can just select this one if you want to have specific this uh, version. Otherwise, if you are in the close future and they have not released any, releases just choose the latest one all right so we're also gonna go and add this extra config we're gonna copy this and of course to come to this page you're just gonna google t-rex github hit enter just go to uh, releases and this should take you to this page all right so we're gonna copy this Gonna go back to HiOS and paste it under extra configs. Like that. Now we're gonna go and click on apply changes. We're gonna name this to whatever you like. So in my case, I'm just gonna name this to T-Rex 0.24.7. Minor. Okay, after that, just click on create flight sheet. Like that, we can see the new flight sheet right here. We're gonna go to the workers. We're gonna click on the worker you want to apply this uh, flight sheet to. We're gonna go to flight sheets. We're gonna go to our flight sheet and just click on this rocket launch icon. All right, and after that, just click on apply. So now, uh, HiOS will send the config to your rig. We're gonna go to overview. And of course, we need to have some overclocking settings to get maximum hash rate. So at the moment I have zero overclocking settings. And also disclaimer, you overclock your GPUs at your own risk. So the overclocking settings I'm gonna get is from uh, hashrate.no. We're gonna go to LHR, locate 3060 Ti LHR or any other GPU. We're gonna go down to Ethereum, now you can choose uh, to overclock with uh, low, medium, high, or if you have high next memory. So in my case, I'm gonna overclock this high and see how much I can get. So we have core clock, 1600, memory clock, 2800, and wattage, 165. So let's go back to HiOS, apply your own uh, settings depending on how high you will overclock your GPU. 
in my case we have 1600 for core clock memory clock 2800 fan speed i'm just gonna add 80 percent but you can add like zero for auto fan so in my case i'm gonna add 80 percent after that we're gonna add power limit 165 so uh, for fan speed you can play around if your card is not that hot you can maybe go for zero and let your gpu decide the fan speed after that we're just gonna go and click on apply and as you can see without any overclocking settings we got 38.58 and now we're just gonna wait and see how much uh, we can get with this uh, new t-rex uh, release and with these overclocking settings from hashrate.no we are gonna go and start up the remote access we're gonna go to hive shell start so we can see the actual uh, t-rex miner in action so we're just gonna wait for hive shell all right so now we're gonna go and click on this icon this will start up the computer we're gonna type in minor hit enter so now we can see the T-Rex in action right here. We have at the moment 46.24, uh, LHR 74.0. So uh, T-Rex will increase this if uh, it's stable, just to get the most hash rate as possible. All right, so we'll run this for almost an hour and after that we're gonna see the results. Okay everyone, so I have run the T-Rex miner software for one hour and 44 minutes and 37 seconds. And my result is uh, I'm getting about 46 and I'm also getting 47. So it fluctuates between 46 and 47 back and forth. All right, so the LHR, it uh, went up to 75 and at 75 I got steady 47 megahertz per second but it went back to 74.5 and now I get 46 47 all right we have power consumption between 125 watts and 134 watts we have fixed fan speed 80% we also have performance efficiency of 369 okay everyone so these are my result with the new T-Rex miner 0.24.7 if you want to join our Discord server, we are all about mining. You can also find the specific uh, overclocking LHR card category and also the 3060Ti LHR uh, channel right here. If you want to talk about your uh, card or overclocking settings and mining problems and things like that. We're growing each day, so you're most welcome to join. Have an awesome day, take care and bye.